Good evening, this is the Oscar expert here with Brother Bro. It's time for the Golden Globe nominations, and we're going to react accordingly to whatever they choose to do to us. As always, these reactions are more based on what we expected to happen rather than our personal opinions. Well, we'll let you know if personal opinions are involved. Oh, what, already? <laughs> ah, Fincher, oh my fucking- Fincher? Fincher. Oh my god, they're not- Three women! Three fucking women. Sorkin and Zhao. It's done! It's done! Chloe Zhao! Oh! Back Spike Lee! Back Spike Lee! Oh my god! Look at your eyes! 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 What's really fucking happening? Oh my goodness! I can't- Bakalova. Bakalova. Oh! What? 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 <laughs> what? <laughs> the CIA? Who? Wait, wait. I could not hear it. I could not hear it. I couldn't hear anything. Do you remember I fucking told you about that movie last night just to scare you? Yeah, that was hilarious and I didn't think it was going to happen. Great director oh lineup. My Great. They're going to nominate music. This is hilarious. Oh, oh my oh, fucking god, it's on Meryl Streep! How could the wait, Golden Globes? Wait, how wait, could the Golden Globes? It's not Meryl Streep! The Golden so Globes! No, no, there was more! Meryl Streep! Also, also, no! Rube, what are her? Rashida Jones! She's gone! Oh, no. no, Rashida Jones! Oh, no. She's not here. We don't even have time to grieve for, for Kristen Milioti or Rada Blank. We have no time to oh. grieve. They're gonna nominate and music. Oh, and then they did Anya Taylor-Joy. shut the fuck up. They're gonna nominate music instead of the prom. Well, I'm glad that James Corden's not getting nominated at least. I I was I was having a little bit of a nightmare no, about that. There we go, Riz Ahmed. Javik Bozeman. The father, nice. Delroy Linda. Whoop. No! What? what? Delroy Lindo! What? Delroy fucking Lindo! They're not gonna nominate the five votes for a no, single award! No, they already snubbed it for director! They hate the five How? votes! They hate the five votes! We, we were aware that Tahar Rahim was potentially getting nominated. But I, didn't get, I thought Gary Oldman was exchangeable. And you're, you, need, you need to wipe your like, face a little bit because you spit on yourself. <laughs> Sasha Baron Cohen? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. But no, oh, what? <laughs> James Wait, Gordon? Dev Patel? Okay. Are you kidding me? Nice. There we go. James Gordon. Oh, yeah. Viola nice, Davis. Nice. Andre Day. They oh, were saying fuck. people were they saying were that shit. Good. Oh, there, that, He's a woman there. That's nice. Five. Francis McDonald. Oh, and top Carrie Mulligan. Top five. And Carrie Mulligan. There you go. But who got snubbed? Nobody got snubbed. It was just the fifth slot. Oh yeah, they didn't do this. No Maya. Sophia Lawrence. No Sophia Lawrence. <laughs> Mank. Mank. No, no my land. land. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh. Yeah. So locked in, I can't even. The father. The father. The father. The father, the father was, gets it, in. It was not one night in Miami. Oh my god. No Ma Rainey. No one night in Miami. To be honest, promising young woman could win. Shit. Yeah, Carrie yeah. Mulligan yeah. is looking. At a win! Are you real? Are you aware of that? Oh, I am definitely going to be predicting her. She's going to go to number one after this. Yes. Yes. Daniel also, Kaluuya shows no up. one I met me. Look what they do. Oh! Oh! What? <laughs> the Murray. What? No <laughs> Kingsley Benadir. Yeah, no fucking Jerry Leto. Oh my God! A mother is fucking Jerry Leto. Of the earth. What? Who? Wait, wait. Where? Oh, 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 despot, despot. It's oh. okay, it's score. <laughs> okay, News of the world. Minutes. News of the world. Trent Reznor, Atticus Ross, Mank. Mank, not Trent Soul. Reznor, Atticus Ross, oh, both, both. both. John Batiste, Soul. John Batiste, nice. there you go. Try, no trial. Borat, subsequent Borat, okay. Hamilton. 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 Palm Springs. Yes! yes! Congratulations to all the Wait, did she say three names? Wait, I'm going back. What? three names. Palm Springs. Music. Music. <laughs> the problem. <laughs> <laughs> what? They yeah. nominated music. Are you kidding me? Wait, is that a real movie that I need to see? What's the deal with that? I don't even know anything about this. <laughs> you bitch. Is on gold I, I fucking told you this was a thing that could happen. <laughs> <laughs> now you watch. They nominate Maddie Ziegler and supporting actress. Okay, wait. What did they snub? Oh, no, on the rocks. That was. 
That was expected yeah, at that, that point. That oh point. my god. But they nominated Bill Murray. And yet, of course, they can't resist the prom, ultimately. They nominated three musicals. They literally cannot resist. I'm surprised at this point that they actually resisted Cat. The did we acknowledge that they nominated Lynn manuel Miranda, but they didn't nominate Leslie Odom Jr.? They didn't that nominate actually Odom happened? Jr. Yeah, that actually happened just like Gold Derby thought it would. We, we haven't there. grieved for Paul Racy yet. Oh, shit. They didn't nominate Paul Racy. Am I wrong? Well, we weren't expecting it, were we? In a way. Glenn Close. Glenn Close. There she is. Olivia, Olivia Coleman. Coleman. There she is. There we go. Probably doing very well. Jodie Foster. Jodie Foster. I might be five out of we five. We might be here. five out of five here. Five out of five here. Mm -hmm. just no Ellen Burstyn. They snubbed Ellen Burstyn for oh, Helen fucking Zangle. Oh, are you kidding me? Helen is Angle and no Burstyn for Zangle. Oh, why your own? I got nominated. The Life Ahead. Minari. Minari. There's the bone. Two of us. Oh my god, she has cat litter on her nose. She was eating cat okay, shit. Okay, another round got nominated. No, this is snow. That's cat shit. That's cat litter. Goodbye, I carry you with me. It was not there. Nominating La Llorona was quite interesting, though. Yep, yep. Three nominations for her. Mank. Mank. Aaron Sorkin. 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 And the father's gonna get nominated. Okay, and they're gonna nominate the picture top five. Lorena Zeller. That's that's the picture yeah, top five. That's the drama top five. Yeah. So that no one, one was not a surprise based on what we had already experienced. One night Miami. That's right. That's right. That's pretty, one night Miami. Pretty, pretty poor. Pretty poor turnout. Let's be honest. They couldn't have really Kingsley Benadire, and they chose Jared Leto. Just remember that when you're mad at something that got snubbed, thing they chose Jared Leto over that. Oh, is that a contender now? Judas. Trial of Chicago Seven. Oh, the life ahead. The life ahead. Speak now. Speak now, of course. Billy Holiday, two nominations. Cruz, Cruz told you, told Cruz, you, told you, told you. Cruz. Onward. Over the yep. moon. All okay, right. top five so, for us. So, if you haven't been listening to me, it's the, the Cruz is the fifth slot. It's not the Willoughby's. It's definitely not Earwig. And it's not Sean the Sheep. It's the Cruz. I've been telling you this. Thoughts and takeaways. The Five Bloods gets less nominations than music and <laughs> Billy Holiday. Zero. No, it got Goose Egg. Sound of Metal got one nomination. So On the Rocks, anyone, only one nomination. Yeah. It turns out that Promising Young Woman was like Mad Max and Budapest where people are like, oh, I don't know exactly, if it's going to do well. And then yeah. it did. But we were, we were weary out. of doing that. Well, so Promising Young Woman has solidified itself as a Best Picture dire Best Director nominee at the Oscars. Let's be fucking oh, yeah. perfectly honest here. Across the board. I mean, DGA nomination even at this point. People overhyped the father going down. Oh no, the father's not getting nominated. That was, <laughs> that was completely overhyped. Those movies are completely invigorated. They did ex excellent. So Hamilton doesn't show like a lot, but it gets actor and it gets picture. I mean, that's what you expect. They nominated Lin-Manuel as a way to say thank you for Hamilton. Isn't that dumb even, though? Even that's though such a, like, Odom Jr. is like the better performance. Yeah, isn't that just like a, a very political nomination of like, we're just gonna, Give it, not not because of the performance, just because. We don't want Hamilton at these awards. It's not like, it's not a film like the other ones are. We did not see an, an overperformance of Judas. Judas. It might take a little time to warm up in the microwave, but and it might. at it least Kaluuya got in there and it got a song nomination. So that's kind of something. I still don't doubt that that movie's getting nominated for Best Picture. Man. Mank got nominated for fucking Mank everything. Mank is still on the life. Got boat. nominated for everything. Yeah. Trial of Chicago 7 did very well. The only thing I missed was score. So there you go. And it didn't get second supporting actor. I'm, I'm completely done predicting that anywhere. Regina King getting director is like kind of, you know, the Golden Globes did their thing and they nominated an actor director, but that movie missed screenplay and picture. It kind of makes sense that it's there. One Night Miami feels like a number seven or something. Minari got completely shut out as we predicted, except for foreign film. We did, did we yeah, not, not even that? score? That fucking even sucks. Score. No Yoon Yoo Jung. Nothing. Minari can rebound at the Oscars. I cannot get over that they nominated James Corden, but not Meryl Streep. Like they've never, ever snubbed Meryl Streep. Oh God. For a movie that she was actually number one for Gold Derby on. Rest in peace to everybody who predicted Wild Mountain Time. I respect the ambition, but it, it didn't It didn't play out, did it? I'm very relieved that they nominated Palm Springs at least though. Kristen Milioti was, I, I, I was saying like, that's kind of wishful thinking. I want that to happen. What do we think about Ma Rainey? Because that, that basically pulled offenses. Ma Rainey in a way does feel like a movie that has like less passion behind it you know sure the performances but it's not like that big of a crowd pleaser i think the five bloods is done we've been saying it i've been doubting it a lot lately because it's been doing so well at early stuff but for the globes not to nominate it why are they like supposed to nominate it more than anybody else because it just felt like i'm not going to be predicting that for picture i'm telling you i'm just not going to do it no, promising young no. woman's in there father's in there people were like yeah. taking out these two movies to fit five bloods 
Don't do that anymore. We were saying, okay, they're going to skip over Gary Oldman. Like he's, he's seeming weak. He's seeming, you know, like he, he's on his last leg. What do you know? They put him there and they even took him above Delroy Lindo. Not everybody likes the five bloods. Just have to be honest about that. And watch it get snubbed at the SAG Awards tomorrow. Is Andre Day a one-off thing? I don't know. I mean, I, I'm sure she gives a great performance in it. So maybe she is a little bit bigger of a contender than we thought. Sophia Lawrence, just not a thing. She's just not a thing. Yeah, it's it's her or Zendaya, and now Andre Day has some steam. I still feel like Burstyn has a better shot at like SAG and Oscar than the Golden Globe, perhaps. That's a that's a pretty brutal snub. Three female directors. That I'm almost positive is like unprecedented. That's they, they may have never nominated two. And for the category to be a majority of women, people are gonna be looking at the Oscars to nominate at least two. And I think Emerald Fennel's in there. Two women nominees this year. It's Emerald Fennel and Chloe Zhao. The fact that Regina King got in here makes sense just because like Globes and and their their actor directors that they love. I don't know if I respect, expect King to get in elsewhere because One Night in Miami wasn't really like a top five kind of movie for them. Music has a 29 on Rotten Tomatoes with seven reviews. This didn't even feel like a, a movie. It felt like a, a like a Disney Plus like streaming event kind of thing. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. You, you gonna be okay?